Hello! Welcome back to the channel. I'm back at it again with buying the worst rated slimes. Why? Why do I do this? Because I'm a curious person. Why are these slimes rated the way they are? Why aren't they rated higher? You know, what if they have the potential? What if they're actually good? This is why this video exists. And I love making these videos and you guys seem to like it too. So that's another reason, of course. Anyways, in case you're new, I buy these slimes on Amazon. I just set the filters to one star and up. Then I just scroll and select some slimes and review them. The first slime that I'm going to review is called Pink Cloud Slime Scented Slime Kit for Girls, Boys, Super Soft Slime Game, DIY Kids Education Toy, Birthday Gift, 7 ounces, 200 milliliters. I just wanted to let you guys know exactly what I'm buying and how it's stated in the listing. At first glance, I thought this looked gorgeous. This is a dual toned cloud slime with some fruit themed accessories, specifically the peach. This was rated 2.7 out of 5 stars, which is quite low. There were only two reviews and this one says the slime did look as pictured and arrived fast. Unfortunately, it left residue all over hands and table. It doesn't smell very good either. Probably will not play with it again. This one says wouldn't buy again. It was really flaky and left bits of it on the table and my hands. Something that I saw in both of these reviews is talking about the residue and leaving a mess on the table. Let's see if I'm going to experience the same thing. Voila, here is the first slime. By the way, all of the slimes came in one mailer for me. All of the add-ons came in a separate baggie along with the peach charm as well. So there were some pink and yellow sprinkles and some peach female slices. Usually I prefer if the a separate baggie of add-ons was on the outside of the container rather than on the inside but because the texture of this is a cloud it's okay I guess because it, it won't sink in just because of how cloud slimes are if you know you know but anyways this is a really dense and thick cloud slime when I first stretched it it ripped but you, you gotta play with them more and stretch them more and once you do that the stretching is beautiful on point and the drizzles were just so smooth there was some minor fallout not that big of a deal i mean with any cloud slime you should expect some fallout because of the snow that's used although i do want to say the sprinkles do fall out a lot so i don't recommend adding it into the slime it smelled really nice the best Best way I would describe it in my own terms, sweet caramel. That's what it reminded me of. Overall, I was really pleased with this. I thought that this slime was harshly rated. I don't think it deserves the rating that it got. Definitely deserves higher. The next slime is called a Baye Day. A Baye Day? I am having a Baye Day. Thank you very much. Okay, you know what? Okay. Jelly Cube Crunchy Slime, Clear Slime for Girls, Boys, Non Sticky Slime, Stress Relief Toy, and Party Prizes, 8 ounces, 200 milliliters. Okay, not gonna lie, the stitch charm was pulling me in. It was calling me to buy this slime, and so I did. I don't know how this is only 2.5 stars. That is low. There was only one review for this. They said meh, but they rate this a 4 star out of 5. The title is contradicting the rating. They said 
It's fine slime, but the cubes weren't soaked before being put in or something, so some didn't want to mash up very well. The sprinkle things fell out super easily and I don't know, it wasn't the best to play with. I've made better jelly slime, but as a cute gift for a kid, it's perfectly fine. This person is definitely experienced with slime for sure. Unfortunately, I'm gonna start off with something negative about this. The smell, because it was the first thing I noticed. This literally smelled like cigarettes. I am not joking. It smelled so bad. I hate, hate, okay, capital H, the smell of smoke, okay? I cannot stand it. No offense to smokers. I mean, it's your life. You do your thing, but I, oh, oh my god. I cannot, I cannot. So it wasn't pleasant for me to play with this. Besides that, I must say this does look really pretty. It's super clear. It came with all of the add-ons. It had green sprinkles and some star sprinkles as well. And it came with the adorable Lilo charm. This had a slow stretch, so you have to stretch it slow or it would rip. Jelly cubes were fine. You can squish them. They were really satisfying to squish great for poking. Also, this was quite thick, which I like. I like thick clear slimes. It makes okay bubble pops. This is the true prime example of major potential, but the scent ruined it. Next one is called Ja Skuwa Pink Peachy BBs. Hold up, wait a minute, wait a damn minute. Is that legal? I'm pretty sure that's not. Using another shop's name in your listing and marketing it as a product from that shop when it's not is probably not a good idea. Butter slime, fragrance, and elastic toys, party prizes, school education, birthday gifts for boys and girls, 200 milliliters. They definitely made the slime look amazing in the pictures. It's a dual toned butter slime with some sprinkles and a peach charm. Slime kit for girls 10 to 12. What does that even mean? Why is that so specific and so exclusive? Anyone of any age can buy slime. Y'all, I'm not having a good impression so far. This was 3.8 out of 5 stars, which is actually pretty decent. So there were a mix of some positive and negative reviews. This one was positive. They said, this is a good slime, but it is not very stretchy at first, but when it is played with it, it gets better. I recommend getting this if you like butter slime and it is very pretty after you mix it up because at first it is white and pink but after mixing it up it is light pink next one is also positive they said good slime but stinky this is a great slime but the scent could be changed because this smells like straight caca <laughs> good to know that this does not smell good but it's a good slime this one is a negative one they said underwhelming and sticky after reading the reviews i had such high hopes for this slime the charm is cute it would be more fun if it was an actually peach shape and not like a button the sprinkles also leave something to be desired i do like that the sprinkles and charm are placed in the jar in a separate bag so that they can be mixed in when you choose the biggest problem is the slime is sticky and sticks on your hands and table. I can't allow my five-year-old to play with it since it ends up all over the place. This slime doesn't smell at all like peach or really anything resembling fruit. It's not an awful smell, but I would not say it's scented as described. This person said, not worth buying. It started drying up after 20 minutes of playing with it. It felt like just like clay and the stretch was okay. It copies the name of a shop, Peachy BBs. It's not worth buying, but if you want clay slime then this is for you. I definitely agree that they copied the 
PGBB's shop name. One star. Product is not good. Send me another one or give me a refund. Slime was in a liquid form. May I get the orange one, please? Thank you. <laughs> so there's like a mix of positive and negative reviews. I was really happy to see how the pink and white can be clearly seen. It didn't mix at all during shipping, which was great. However, this just felt like straight up clay, like about 90% clay and 10% and slime. The way it stretches is similar to a putty. It's really stringy. It is quite soft. You do still need a tiny bit of strength to stretch it, poke it, squish it, or whatever. All of the add-ons came in a separate baggie. It came with green and red sprinkles along with some flower sprinkles as well and the peach charm. Again with the green sprinkles, I keep seeing it. Also this has a similar scent to the cloud slime that I reviewed. That sweet caramel scent. I mean I was just okay with this just because it felt more like clay than slime and it didn't really feel like a true butter slime. Like I wanted. This one is called 2-Pack Cake Butter Slime Kit Scented Putty Slime Supplies for Kids Party Favors Soft and Non-Sticky Stress Relief Toy for Girls, Boys, Education, Party Favor Gift, and Birthday. I had to buy this one because this was a 2-Pack of Butter Slime for only $5.99. I had to see if this is too good to be true because that is cheap. This was rated 3.3 out of 5 stars, which is average, still a little bit on the lower side. This person said has little white balls in it. I like the buttery texture of this, but there are hundreds of little white tiny balls and they fall off and make a huge mess as you play with the slime. I would not buy this brand again and I am tempted to return it. Uh, those tiny white balls are called microflown beads. This one is a positive one. They said, cute. Two come in the package. There's not much scent, but they're easy to play with. Not sticky at all. A little hard to get out of the bottle, but they are cute. It was terrible and nothing but glue. I enjoy slime very much. However, I've ordered slime from multiple places. Peachy, okay, it's peachy babies, not peachy babies. By far is the best slime I've experienced this far. I have ventured out and wanted to try some off Amazon, but this brand is terrible. It's not slime at all. It's mainly glue and color and it smells terrible. Would not recommend for children or anybody for that matter. It is sticky. It is so, so, so sticky. It has an instruction and it says put it in the fridge for half an hour. It is still sticky. It is a horrible slime. Do not buy that butter slime. It does not stretch at all. It's a waste of money. So sticky. Advertised as non-sticky, but there's no way to touch it without it clinging to your hands and making a terrible mess. I could barely get it out of the jar and had an awful mess. Don't waste your money. Okay, it seems like the common denominator in most of these reviews is that it's sticky. Well, now that makes me question if Activator will be able to fix it or is it gonna arrive sticky? As soon as I saw this tiny box, I knew the price for this was too good to be true. I mean, $5.99 for two slimes that look like it's at least six ounces. That's really cheap. The pictures definitely made them look like they're bigger than they actually are. This felt similar to the previous slime that I reviewed, that peach themed butter slime. This felt just like that. It felt more like clay than slime. This one was softer. Thankfully, mine did not come sticky at all. It was fine for me. With the review that mentioned the white flown beads, I definitely felt 
out some of it and they did not fall off at all for me and I thought it added a nice touch to the texture so like I said with the previous slime this one stretches like putty it's stringy the ending color is a Tiffany blue color which is beautiful it came with Christmas themed sprinkles which I thought was a random combination because it came with an Oreo charm also this smelled like popcorn to me which is also really random This one is similar to the blue and white one where it just felt like straight up clay. Actually, this looks similar to the peach butter slime that I reviewed, but this is just smaller. It came with green sprinkles yet again. It's an occurring thing so far. It also came with grapefruit female slices and the pink Oreo charm. Now this one didn't smell like popcorn to me. This smelled like that same sweet caramel smell. I'm not sure why I keep smelling the same scent for a lot of these slimes, but here we are. <laughs> Last but not least, this one is called Claire Kits with Pineapple Charm Crunchy Non-Sticky Super Soft Sludge Toy DIY Crystal Glue Boba Slime for Kids, Girls, Boys. Look at the pineapple charm in the middle. It is so cute. Had to buy this one. Also, it was $5.99, which is also inexpensive. This was 3.3 .3 out of 5 stars, which is... On the lower side, here is a positive review. Pretty good for price. So when I first opened it, I noticed the smell and it smelled like honey medicine and I personally don't like it when I touched it. It is a bit rippy and it's almost impossible to stretch at first, but then when you start to play with it, when you stretch slowly, it's better, but still rippy when you poke it. Overall, good slime, especially for the price because I saw some slimes that were smaller but the same price or more expensive. The only bad thing for me is the smell and ripping. The charms are green and pink, fake sprinkles and little pineapples. The big charm is like a pineapple with a face. Wait, what did I just read? That did not make sense to me. Five stars, really love, nice bubble pops, good consistency, came as described. Have to be on the slower side with stretching for it to stretch properly, but I think that's the type of slime. Best part is how it slowly droops on its own when held up, then gives good pops, smells like honey. Just, it was a good delivery. I didn't dislike anything. It was perfect, but they gave it three stars. Interesting. Okay. Smells really weird. It has a weird smell and it's very pungent. The slime isn't really stretchy either. It comes with its add-ons and charms. They may fall out sometimes though. Non-stretchy and super strong scent. While the slime itself is very thick, the slime is very non-sticky to the point where it breaks off like jello. The scent is also super strong. It's a very strong honey and nectar smell, so it makes playing with it a nauseating experience. Okay, so from what I gathered, this has a very strong scent and it's possibly not that stretchy, but it seems like it's a good slime for the price. How is this 3.3 stars? This is the best slime in this entire package easily. Easily the best. It's super clear, crystal clear. It's so cute, it's beautiful. Finally, there is a variety of colored sprinkles, not just green. There was also pineapple female slices along with the adorable pineapple charm. This is thick just the way I like it. This is a slow stretch. You definitely need to stretch it slow or it can rip. It's amazing for poking and squishing. It makes okay bubble pops though. It smelled like honey and nectar like the reviews say and it is quite strong and I can see how it can be nauseating for some people. Personally for me, I didn't mind it. I actually really liked the smell. For only $5.99, this is a banger.
Well, that wraps up this video. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!